This is Skip from the WSGF and today we're going to take a look at daisy chaining two monitors through DisplayPort multi-stream transport. Um, I've had a couple of monitors that have had this feature. This is the very first time I've ever tried it or checked it out so we'll be doing this live to see if it runs smoothly or if there are any hiccups or gotchas. Uh, these are the two of the new Dell 25 inch 1440p monitors. They both have DisplayPort out. It's a full-size DisplayPort out. Um, in both panels, I've gone in and turned on the DisplayPort 1.2 feature. I'm not sure why you would have to turn it on. I don't know why that's just not enabled by default, but on your monitor, whatever brand or whatever model, make sure the feature is turned on if you try this. So we have an input from a Radeon R9-295, a mini DisplayPort, out from that going into a full-sized display port on the uh, panel that you can see that's active and then I have the full-size cable output from that on the display port out and I'm about to plug this in here to the uh, display port input <clears throat> so it appears that it just simply works which is good which is what we would want. Um, it has it set up here as an extended desktop. One other thing we'll look at is in the AMD Catalyst control panel. Um, if you come down under information, when you have an MST hub set up, I remember this from when I had the Club 3D hub set up, there is a tab here for DisplayPort Diagnostics. You can see that the port here has a total bandwidth available of 20.76 gigabits per second. We're using 70% of that. Each of the two monitors, again, Dell U2515Hs, are pulling 7.25%. So they're each pulling 35% of the available bandwidth. So on DisplayPort 1.2, you'd be able to hook up two 1440p monitors, but not three, as three times 35 would be 105% and exceed the available bandwidth. And when we looked at the Club 3D MST hubs, we did show that you could do a 21 by 9, 2560 by 1080, plus two 1080Ps for mixed mode iFinity off of one port. Uh, there's enough bandwidth there out of DisplayPort 1.2 for that. So easy, works simple. Uh, what more can you ask for?